It's the most extra thing I've ever ordered probably, but I've been getting it a lot recently, which is absolutely insane and I still don't know how to feel about it. So to really get the vibes right, I put on a Yule log. I think what's helping me is just being thankful for the time that I have had and the friendships and relationships that I've made because of track. Good morning you guys and welcome back to my channel. If you're new, my name is Allie and I am a college student living in Minnesota, up in Duluth. Um, today is going to be a few days of my life in college. I'm starting the vlog off in the car right now. I'm going to get a coffee before one of my, well not, it's not a Zoom class, it's a Zoom meeting. But I have one meeting today and then I'm hoping later on to decorate my room for Christmas. I went to Target yesterday and got some decorations, just like minimal stuff since I won't be here the week of Christmas because I'll be going home to see my family but I thought I would start off the vlog and I'm gonna head to Starbucks and then get on my meeting. Just got home. It's like five minutes not even. Um, but I have about 20 minutes until my meeting and so I think I might show you guys all of the decorations and stuff that I got for my room. First though, I got a grande iced coffee with no classic, two pumps of white mocha, and vanilla sweet cream cold foam on top, which is like it's the most extra thing I've ever ordered probably, but I've been getting it a lot recently. Rachel Ratke here on YouTube, that's like her order that she's been getting recently, but super good. Highly recommend if you are a coffee drinker and if you're not, I do also really like iced chai with the sweet cream cold foam. That's also super good. But yeah, so I thought I would share my coffee order, but I think I might put you right here and then just... Yeah, we'll do that. Okay. <clears throat> so the first thing I got was this little flocked tree. I really liked this because when I'm older, I, when I have an apartment or a house or whatever, I actually want to get a flocked tree. So this is, this is my version for now. <laughs> and then um, I got some of these command hooks because there's some stuff that I'll show you that I'm going to be hanging up in my room. So that's obviously a necessity. And then I got a little stocking to hang up and then I got a couple ornaments that I'm actually gonna hang um, above my windows it's kind of hard to explain but I'll show you guys later but I got three of these little plush snowflakes which I have these at in my room at home and then I also got two of these little stars I just thought they were super cute super simple I'm very much into neutrals as of recently. Well, not recently, I always have been, but love the neutrals, so all that stuff is very neutral. And I think the only color I really have in my room is my pink sheets, but. So yeah, so that is what I got from Target. I'm going to get ready to get on my Zoom call and then I'm probably just gonna be doing a lot of homework the rest of the day besides when I obviously want to decorate my room which I'll show but it's getting to be the end of final season or like it's getting to be the end of the semester and final season so lots of work to be done today I registered for my last semester of undergrad which is absolutely insane and I still don't know how to feel about it but I might talk about that a little bit more later but until then I'm gonna get on this zoom call zoom university and I will catch up with you guys in a little bit I just finished eating 
lunch after my Zoom call. So I think what I'm gonna do now is actually decorate my room because I need a little break and I'm gonna be grinding the rest of the day on one assignment that's due tonight. So I thought that I would show you guys me decorating, that's it. <laughs> so I think the first thing is where I'm gonna put the tree. So I have this little spot right here and this is from my high school track coach. He put this together for the U of M women's cross and track team when he coached them. But I'm gonna put that on my desk. I should probably have it where I can read it always anyway. So I'm gonna put this right here. And then I have all this stuff laid out on my bed. So for the ornament, I think I'm gonna hang them up up here. So I'm gonna do like every other sort of up there. And then for the stocking, I think I'm gonna hang it like that. right I put on a Yule log on YouTube if you haven't done this before I got this from Danielle Carolyn she always does this around the holidays putting a Yule log on her TV also I saw her do the New York skyline and I haven't done I haven't put that on the TV yet but that would be so fun but yeah so put up the stocking the little tree and then this I think is my favorite part I just put those right up there so cute but now that the fun is over i have an assignment due tonight that's like n part of our final project that i need to start working on um but yeah so i think that that's all i really have planned for the rest of the day is just to work on that assignment and then watch football at some point usually i go over to the boys house my guy friends and watch the football with them but because i have that assignment i think i'm just gonna put it on my tv but if i have any other updates i'll pop in but yeah pretty pretty boring monday but productive you have to be your biggest fan and when things are really tough and they're really rough and nothing's working but there's something inside of you that says, I just have to follow that. Because you don't know who you're going to be. Who you gonna be. Who you gonna be. It is obviously much later now. And I have been working on that project, like I keep saying. And then I also hopped on another Zoom meeting to help my professor out with one of the classes I've already taken for my major. But... Um, I just preheated the oven. I'm gonna heat up some leftover pasta and put some cheese on top or something like that, I think, for dinner. And then, again, the rest of my night will consist of doing this one assignment. But I kind of wanted to talk about um, the fact that I'm a senior and I registered today, so I've just like had a lot of thoughts and feelings about that I guess um I am a college athlete I'm I run track here at UMD and this is supposed to be my last season like 
obviously because I'm a senior. I have extra eligibility. I would have a full another season if I decided to use it, but this is supposed to be my last year because I'm graduating and stuff. And I have mixed feelings about this, especially with the pandemic. I just hope that we're able to wrap things up and I get to compete one last time because it would give me a lot of closure, I think, with all of it. Um, but that it's all just up in the air right now. We just don't know. And so I have a lot of decisions that I need to make about like what I want the next year to look like if I decide I want to stay and do track, if I decide it's time for me to move on and get a big girl job and things like that. But it's really hard. It's hard for people that don't have sports. It's hard for everyone. And if you're a senior or you're a college athlete that's, no matter what year you are, that's lost time in your sport, I understand and I'm sorry that it is the way that it is. But I think what's helping me is just being thankful for the time that I have had and the friendships and relationships that I've made because of track. And I hope that I get to continue just being a part of the sport, whether that's through coaching or being a spectator or I don't know what. I'd love to coach someday, but yeah. I just kind of wanted to say that if you're struggling, I feel you, it's hard, I'm struggling with it a little bit, but being optimistic about all, it all because that's all you really can do. But yeah, so I think I'm going to eat. I would like to do a little workout tonight, even if it's just like a little bit of yoga before bed, but that'll all depend on this assignment that I've procrastinated on but yeah so I'm hoping to pick this vlog up again either tomorrow or Wednesday I'd like it to be a few days but if not and if this is long enough this might be the last day but yeah I'm excited this is the first time I'm actually vlogging and I feel like it's been a good day. I've been able to show and talk to the camera and not be nervous. I mean, I am nervous, but like not as bad as I thought. But yeah, so I think again, going to eat, going to do some work, maybe a little yoga and get ready for bed stuff, but I just wanted to check in and have that little chat. And yeah. It is the next day and I'm coming on here to end this vlog but I wanted to say if you've made it to this point in the video and you watched my whole first vlog thank you and I hope that you want to stick around and <laughs> to subscribe I'm really excited to share my memories and the things that I love and all of that so I'll see you guys in the next one